hello, welcome back one and all. Um, what am I playing here? No Man's Sky. Um, my friend got this for me. And I've been wanting to play it for... Uh, it's funny, it seems the theme, the common theme for a lot of these games that I play is... I've been wanting to play it for a long time. And the only reason I didn't was because I just simply didn't own it. Um, and that's the same for this game. My friend got it for me. Um, and I've, you know, only seen news of it. I, I didn't get it when it first came out. And um, I obviously didn't get it even when it went on really good sale because I was just like I don't know indifferent about it I've I've heard countless times that oh my gosh it's so much better now and you know I, I believed it I just yeah never really gave it a chance um, despite my curiosity to my to, to play it so uh, here we are um, I think we should just do a normal game Down. Oh, these controls here. So confusing already. Kidding. Oh yeah, I changed the uh can't really see it. I changed the uh, this is Fahrenheit right here. I had to change it from Celsius to Fahrenheit because you know, I actually can't uh, understand Celsius. American, right? But you know, one of the okay, so um, I had the uh, uh, interesting, funny conversation with my with my father just the other day. Um, let's see, was that 10, 5, so 15? Is that 15? A zine 15? Is X is 10, B5. Oh, no, that's 16. Because V1 is 6. Okay, so I just need to... I need to get warm. I don't know if I'm supposed to kill this thing. Probably not. Um, anyway, so I had an interesting conversation. Interesting, funny with my dad the other day because um, we were talking about, uh, okay, let's see. Huh? I must find ferret dust. Alright, ferrite dust. Okay. Um. Oh, look. Ooh. Is that frame rate happening? Um, so you know how in The Lord of the Rings, I don't know if you if you've read the book or the movie, but both say the same thing. Um, in the in the moment where the hobbits are getting chased by the Black Rider, um, Mary is talking about. Okay, where the skin. Yeah, critically damaged. I'm trying to repair it before I die here. Okay, so that's melee. Oh, look at that. Neat. Neat. Scan for sodium. Sodium is NA. Um. In the part where they're being chased by the the Black Rider, um, Frodo yells out to Mary and says, "How far is the nearest crossing from the uh, Buckleberry Ferry?" Okay. And you know when oh, I just need to press E. Oh. Recharge as there's protection. Okay. 
Okay, alright. So you just have to gather ingredients that will that will successfully dude this thing looks like it's from spore you guys remember spore oh jet back cool um okay so anyway what didn't make sense to me in that scene though whether it's you know movie or book is that um Is that in there? Mary says the the closest and uh, nearest crossing from the Buckleberry Ferry is 20 miles, and that never made, that didn't like make sense to me. I was like, why is he why is he saying miles instead of kilometers? Because the book is supposedly meant to take place um, is supposedly meant to take place. In old England, because one of the main reasons Tolkien wrote the book was because he wanted to create sort of like a mythology for um, old England, because a lot of it, a lot of the mythology had been lost, you know, because what uh, what had been just most recently, or what had just been uh, most commonly. used as far as you know European myth mythology was like Robin Hood and King Arthur right um, those are the like the big names of of a uh, of, of what you would see in that type of mythology um, I, don't know, I don't know what's gonna kill me and it's not gonna kill me Reach the mark signal, right? Oh. Well, it doesn't seem like these things are up to get me. At least not yet. Um, so the movie and the book represent old England, okay? And even if the, even if the, uh, movie wasn't gonna 100% correctly reflect the book, which there are many things that it didn't, and I'm fine with a lot of things that they changed, but um, you'd think that they would maybe change miles from miles to kilometers because that's what they use in the UK. Um, and then Peter Jackson, the director of Lord of the Rings movies, is from New Zealand. And in New Zealand, they use kilometers. They don't use the imperial system. And so, I don't know, there would just be something in my mind that was advanced. Uh, something in, in my, whoa, it's very gorgeous. It would just, you'd, you'd think it'd make sense. That's all I'm saying. Um, however, upon... Is this thing out to get me? Um, upon conversing with my father about this topic, um, he relayed to me that during the time period that Tolkien had written the novels, um, that was when the UK had also implemented the imperial system of measurement. And I knew I knew that at some point.
Um, I knew that, uh, you know, at some point in history, that the that the UK had in fact implemented. I just did. Why is the ground shaking? What did I just do? Um, they had implemented the the uh, what I'm doing right now but then sw they switched back to um, being off of the Imperial system because for some reason and and so that's why um, Tolkien at that point had used miles instead of kilometers The ship at, la at least seems to recognize me. The controls react to my touch, or at least to that of my exosuit. I'm not dead yet, and this ship is a lifeline out of the stars. It's a metal phrase right there. A lifeline out of the stars. Exosuit connected. Suggestion. Pilot should perform maintenance. Select desired repair they say just repair. Initiated. Cool. Okay, so I need to find metal plating and a hermetic seal. Okay. I can read. How about that? Okay. Repair metal plating. What's this? Collected 50 ferrite dust. Hey. By the way, as as these episodes keep coming in, I think for this uh, I will um, I'll make these episodes pretty long, um, just because I don't think I can simply get a lot done in a thirty to forty minute time frame. So I'll probably have these be a little longer, and I mean, Philip, I know if. Um, Philip, your, your Survivor episodes were like over an hour long every single time, so I think you can deal. Um, but I was telling my dad, too, that uh, while he was telling me about... Uh, The UK having gone onto the Imperial system uh, reminded me of this meme, and I'll see if I can't find it really quick. Uh, but it's Anakin from Star Wars Episode 3 just saying, Hold on, this whole thing is your idea. Oh, offer food? Oh, I have to get creature blood. Um,
identify plant. I want to identify it. Or Let's see. Navigate with the scroll wheel sign. Features. Gestures. Photo mode. That's cool. Um. Recharge it. Hey, there we go. Technology recharge. There we go. Ooh. Okay, so I... This one. This guy. Give me that carbon. I need 50 carbon. Where can I find carbon? Does this guy give up carbon? No, just oxygen. You have to be a chemist to play this game. It's like all those people who said you have to be a, uh, you have to have like a master's degree in order to watch Rick and Morty. You have to be a chemist in order to play this game. Craft, carbon, lights. Okay. Now tubes, now tubes, lights. That's just silly. Finalize the installation. Test the analyzed visor. Yeah. Oh, hold it. Okay. Okay, your starship. Hey, I already, I already did that. Hey. Okay. Did that. Personal charges and shelter your ship. Buildings are caves. Okay. Yeah, anyway, so there was a point in history. I keep losing my train of thought. There was a point in history where it was more or less agreed upon that that uh protection technology recharge easy that the entire world would be would begin to using would begin to use uh, the imperial system all the way around It's already scanned, so I don't know. Nice. Analyze. Um, and I'm not entirely sure what made it so that the, the UK and the rest of the world decided to get off of the Imperial system. Um, I'd probably have to ask my sister, she's a historian. I'd probably have to ask her about it. I could Google it, sure, but will I? Unlikely. Oh, let's, uh...
Let's see, unidentified. I mean, to be fair, a lot of the Imperial system just doesn't make sense. Uh, yeah, a lot of the Imperial system just doesn't make sense because, uh, I don't know, trying to remember as a child how many feet are in a mile is just absurd. I mean, I still couldn't tell you right off the top of my head. I would have to look it up. And there are starship critically damaged vital ingredients missing. Unable to synthesize required components. Pulse engine requires hermetic seal. Request assistance, sure. Iteration concurs and reveals hermetic seal nearby. Salvage a planetary chart from distress beacon cache. Okay. So I can't sprint and use my jetpack at the same time. It seems useless. Tab to view data. Here we go. Whoa. understand for a lot of reasons why we don't uh, use Imperial or uh, all the way around the world because a lot of it is just to, to um, translate really um, oh yeah it's fine. Ooh. where's the storm gonna come from if I press M does that M does not show me my I just don't. Uh, so I just don't get to use my map. Pretty scan. Seek shelter in caves or buildings. Charge your hazard projection with sodium. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! I'm gonna die likely. I'm gonna find shelter. But how, how do I know where shelter is? die soon and I don't know how to so it's not that like I immediately die from the storm but it it blasts my my resources burns through them, which is a really funny thing to say, considering an ice storm. And some sodium. I feel like sodium. Technology 
sodium. I don't know, maybe I should, maybe I'm doing it this all wrong. I, um, I'm not good at these games. I mean, uh, you guys saw me play, um, you guys saw me play Moria, Return to Moria, and kind of my, uh, Oh. That's good. Yeah, you guys saw... Frustrating it was sure. watching me play that game. No one making this recording in case leaving behind in the fabricator might be of some use. Visor damaged. Get my chip. I found mine. Um, skill issue. Cover supplies. The log finished and the machine burst to life, spitting out supplies. I have the hermetic seal. I need to repair my ship. Whoever it was that led me here, whoever left this message, perhaps they found themselves in the same situation as I do now. Question mark. Eh, I will just use the first aid. I don't know if I'm going to be back here, really. Maybe I will. guy okay let's see mostly Durino D D Durino what does that mean I don't know if I've rename and upload what just uh, let's just do upload add discovery to personal records give me one sec sorry my uh, my bishop called Always active. I don't know. So I want to know. Let's see. First encounter in the deep. Sense organs in feet. Um, I just want to know if they're like naturally aggressive or whatnot. Um, okay. So, yeah, sorry, my bishop called. I, I have a uh, wedding that I'm going to on Saturday. And I just need to get my my uh, meeting in with them before then. Oh, I mean, I figured it was going to attack me, but I didn't think it... I thought I would have to be a little farther away in order to get me. I hear birds. How are there birds on a planet this cold? Maybe they're not birds, but they're... I don't know. Maybe it's just the other end. It's squeaking. Let's get some carbon. And I keep getting distracted. Like, it should just be a straight shot um, to my ship, and I'm not taking it. Dihydrogen crystals. Di just means like singular, doesn't it? Dihydrogen. So it's like a singular. I mean, 
maybe oh advance these hard. Uh, maybe I'm not asking the right question like Hydrogen. Pretty sure. No, it's just that I'm pretty sure. You know what? I, uh. Close to you, back off. Okay, your structure. I'm really bad at uh, really bad at closing off. Uh, those notifications. Maybe they're already tagged. An oxygen rich plant, I guess. Transforms materials. Where did we do that at? I wanted to turn that light on. Open the inventory. See, my worry is that, um, unless the game does this for me the entire time, I'm never going to know to use these. I see, I see, I see, okay. Um, I really wanted to do it that far away. Maybe I'll just do it. G. Let's see what colors it has. I dig that. So if I need to move it, then I can. All right.
Neat. Gas here. Nice. All systems functional. Pick up the portable refiner. <laughs> okay. We are on. This is cool. Better not crash. Seek answers amongst the stars. Hey, what's this? The satellite ship. Oh, <laughs> I hit the thrusters. Maybe should be a little more Seeing though the marker, huh. okay. I discovered this. Fun. Okay, well, you know, what? I think this actually might be a good place to stop just for our first episode. Um, this seems like it's going to be fun. I mean, it's just a really cool, calm game. Um, and uh, I'll be playing multiplayer with my friends at some point, and uh, I think that'll be fun. So, if you enjoyed this, uh, just let me know, and I can obviously make more, and uh, we'll see you next time. <laughs>